Hi, I will show you how to model this structure. Go to the new tab and start a weldment assembly file. Within that, at the assemble tab, create a part. I will use the metric um, standard millimeters file, call that dodecahedron, and click OK. Start a sketch on the top plane with a polygon of five sided. A vertical constraint of the line and dimension that with 88. Finish the sketch. Make a surface patch on that one. And start a 3D sketch. Include two sides. Start the line right here. Create one plane on that side and another one on the connecting side. Now dimension this angle and the other one. Oops, no, no, no. I mentioned that line and that one with that same value. Now the angle in the five sided polygon is 108 degrees. So I'll type that and finish that sketch. We don't need that plane visible anymore. And we can start the next 2D sketch on that one. Let's see where we are. Just with one more polygon here. Project this line into the sketch. And make this point coincident with that one and that one over here. All right, finish that sketch, make another surface patch. Okay. Um, make that one axis visible. I believe that's the Y axis, All right? And create a pattern. Well, we don't need to see that 3D sketch anymore. A circular pattern of that surface around that axis with five instances. All right. Um, let's stitch all of those together and start another 3D sketch including geometry, just that line, and finish that sketch. We just need a midpoint of that line to create a plane. Yeah. And that way we can mirror those components here. All right, mirror, mirror plane, that one. Okay. But we got to adjust those.
connecting point. That one should be over here, right? So go to move bodies and rotate those ones. Pick the rotate about line tool. And we had measured that this, that angle at 72. And we just need half of that. 72 divided by 2. Apply. Done. All right. We're finished with the surface body and can return to the assembly. And go to the design tab and insert a frame. Okay, first let's save the assembly. Okay, I picked a pipe with that dimension 21.3 times 2.3. And let me just window pick the whole thing and apply. All right, now I want to work on those joints with the miter tool and pick three members at once, accept that, and this looks good. Let's do that a couple of more times, that one. Apply that. And so on. All right. You get the idea, right? Well, thanks for watching. So